Yo, what's up, my people? My name is Oluwa Kayode Benda, aka K Temple. I hail from Ekiti State. I grew up in Ejibo. I'm currently in Ali Mosho and um, doing music. And my kind of music, I'm an Afro pop artist and I'm live here on Promo Media Team. I started my musical career back then in the church because um, I used to go for all these um, um, church competitions. That was when I discovered my talent. Like, okay, I think your talent is music. So I started going to competitions and from there, I started taking myself to the studio. So, and then I, I, I came up with an idea like, let me have a group, um, um, a, a group that they'll be singing with me. So I had a rapper and I had another song that like me so we were all working together like that so we started going to shows from there from there from there from Ejibo I was working from Ejibo so it's, it's so funny and, and 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 come to think of it when I was in Ejibo then my church I have a lot of stars also the likes of Kenny Black Kenny Black was there uh, even Jabless they were all my church members you know, all those times so all of us used to go to some shows together and um, Thank God today for where I am and I thank God for His grace upon my life. And, you know, way back 2000, uh, let me say late 2000, it hasn't been easy, you know, uh, to record song, going to the studio looking for money to record a song. It's not just, it's no sponsor, nobody is ready to even drop money for to do anything. You understand? So it hasn't been easy, but uh, we thank God for His grace and mercy. We are here today. I, I own uh, my own management company, that's ERG Entertainment Limited, Ever Ready Gang. So, and we have been recording and we have been doing a lot of stuff, and God has been faithful to us, and we thank God for that. From um, the likes of um, Asha, Asha was among the artists I was feeling then, because she's someone I, I, I love so much. Asha and um, uh, T Code, and uh, that guy, you know, I, I, I work with that, that bros. Uh, uh, I, I work with him in Abel Kuta, so he's, a great, he's one of the great artists also, and also I, I love Nice so much. So those were the three artists I was really looking up to then, and I really love them so much. The Afrobeat, uh, the response we are we're getting from Afrobeat um, in all, all over the world now is, is really massive, and I wouldn't lie to you, Afrobeat has, has become uh, an household um, an also name whereby everybody wants to everybody wants to fall in, in, in line of um, Afrobeat and people want to people want to really work with Afrobeat artists and Afrobeat has really gone far and wide whereby you you, you see the, the, some kind of um, artist featuring on another artist and the infusion in it is very is very massive and the, 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 the turnover is, is, is crazy Afrobeat is, is, is one of the best is one of the best genre now. In the music industry and it, it's, it's very okay. Yeah, my creative process, um, how, how I record my songs and how I get inspired. Um, whenever I'm in the studio, it, because I have my own my I have my own mobile studio, so sometimes I just I just get to listen to instrumentals. I get to listen to songs. So whenever I listen to some songs like that and I get to listen to some instrumentals, I I, I put myself in the in the music mood. I, I don't need to take anything, I don't need to start getting um, whatever things at order, I don't know. But I myself, K-Tempo, I get inspired anytime, any day. Either I'm in the room, either I'm in the studio, whatever, wherever I am. But most especially, I get my inspiration from... <laughs> I, I don't know if you want to hear this, I get my inspiration from, from, from the toilet sometimes. So all of those things are the things that motivate me and... I can I, I can't really tell you that there is a particular thing that is getting me inspired or whatever, but I know that I'm always inspired by any kind of music that you bring out to me for a record. I'm always there, I'm always good to go. So the relationship between me and P Loops happened to be Praise Igwe, uh, popularly known as P Loops. My relationship with him is not just a friend relationship, it's a brotherly relationship. Uh, because Pilus is a wonderful guy, he's a fantastic guy, a fantastic producer for that. Uh, he, he has produced the likes of um, Olimentine, excuse me, French, um, Emergency, The Bunch, or E for Two Face, yeah, um, Raze, and David Doe, Waiting Day. He has produced a lot of hit songs and he has produced a lot of songs for me as well. And most of my songs that I've been dropping back to back. Philips have been the one behind the the eats. The wonderful guy. Just watch out for him and I I bet you Philips you never saw him coming. He's a great guy, a wonderful one. Yeah, SNT Entertainment uh, was a was a record label I, I was signed 
I was signed in, um, I think some years ago, uh, was owned by Mr. Shegu Ayola. Maximum respect to you, boss. Um, Asante has been a very wonderful man to my musical career and he, he has really been helpful. And um, while with Asante, I work with other artists, likes of um, Shantero, I work with um, um, DP Zoo, I work with um, Isolate, I work with Godlock, I work with so many artists while I was under SNT Entertainment. But right now, we're on ELG Entertainment and it's owned by K Temple. Oof, well, live in Ijibu has not been easy. Hmm, live in Ijibu is, 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 is been, it's been rough, it's been tough, it's been hard not live in Ijibu. You know, in Ijibu, we, we have so many talents, so many talented artists. Both um, in, in acting, music, and all, in likes of him, Lola Lao, you know, um, in, uh, likes of um, Shontero, likes of Jabless, likes of Kenny Black, you know, so and and so on like that. Likes of Young D, a lot of a lot of stars in Ijibu that grew up from even Nines, even Charles Okocha, even um, Morachi, you know, a, a lot of them. Ijibu is a very very big place and. I really want to say something like the government. I will want the government to just come into Ejibu to come and do something nice in that place because people there are really going through a lot. The road side of it is not good at all. We want the government to look into Ejibu, local government, so we can do something that will make the people of Ejibu better again and have a very, very good life to live there. Basically, I'm working on my new single, Lucifer produced by P Loops and um, the, the song has been gaining airwaves and massive plays have been going down and streams have been going and I've been getting a lot of good response from, from the song. Uh, and Lucifer is a, is a very good song because so many people have been asking me Lucifer, 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 what, what, what's Lucifer? Is, is he a diabolic song or what, what are you trying to say? Are you trying? But it's not like that. Really. Lucifer is just a song, you know, it's just the title of a song. I just want to, I, I want to get everybody's attention like I'm waiting with this guy waiting in the talk so you get to listen to my song so you understand and I let me just give you a freestyle from the song uh, it goes uh, that like that part I said he don't they say when me I they sing pray to God pray for grace say make I blow blow like trumpets bank a lot for my bank account you understand I will want you to go download the song and just enjoy it listen to it and Drop your comment. A shout out to my people, shout out to everyone that has been showing me love, shout out to all my fans. I want to thank you all for the support from way back until this moment and it's still going. God bless you all. And my new single is out there titled Lucifer by Kyle the Temple. I want you all to go download. It's available on every platform you can stream and um, just drop your comment. God bless you all. This is your favorite boy, K Temple, aka Kyle the Temple. You know, popularly known as Mr. Ever Ready, and I'm live here on Promo Media TV. Don't touch the dark, leave it. Oh, yeah, turn around, don't be shy. This kind of do we go down tonight?